a reading from the book of Isaiah. For Zion's sake, I will not keep saying. For Jerusalem's sake, I will not rest. Until our dedication goes forth as right and her salvation as a burning torch. The nations shall see your dedication, and all the kings your glory, and you shall be called by a new name, which the mouth of the Lord will give. You shall be a crown of beauty in the hand of the Lord, and a royal diadem in the hand of your God. You shall no more be termed forsaken, and your land shall no more be termed desolate. But you shall be called, My delight is in heaven, and your land married. For the Lord delights in you, and your land shall be married. For as a young man marries a virgin, so shall your sons marry you. And as the bridegroom rejoices over the bride, so shall your God rejoice over you. The word of the Lord. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. When Paul came to Antioch of Pisidia, he stood out in the synagogue. And motioning with his son, said, Men of Israel, and you that fear God, listen. The God of these people, Israel, chose our fathers and made the people great during their stay in the land of Egypt. And with uplifted arm, he led them out of it. Then he raised up David to be their king. Of whom he testified and said, I have found in David the son of Jesse, a man after my heart who will do all my will. Of this man's prosperity, God has brought to Israel a Savior, Jesus, as he promised. Before his coming, John had preached a baptism of repentance to all the people of Israel. And as John was finishing his course, he said, What do you suppose that I am? I am not he. No, but after one, after me, one is coming. The sandals of whose feet I am not worthy to untie. The word of the Lord.
An angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream, saying, Joseph, son of David, do not fear to take Mary a wife, for that which is conceived in her is of the Holy Spirit. She will bear a son, and you shall call his name Jesus. But he will save his people from their sins. And all this took place to fulfill what the Lord had spoken by the prophet. Behold, a virgin shall conceive and bear a son, and his name shall be called Emmanuel, which means God with us. When Joseph woke from sleep, he did as the angel of the Lord commanded him. He took his wife, but knew her not until she had born a son, and he called his name Jesus. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise the Lord Jesus Christ. Uh -huh.